The overall goal of this technique is to transfer chemical processes from batch to flow mode as demonstrated by the reaction of diphenyl diazomethane with paranitrobenzoic acid in a continuous flow reactor. This method can help identify how best to approach the technology transfer of chemical transformations from batch to flow processes. The main advantage of these techniques are chemical reactions that require precise temperature control, enhanced mixing, or highly reactive intermediate or reagents. It is essential to first establish reaction kinetics and operational parameters in batch mode. After reaction optimization, the process can be transferred to flow mode. First, check that each high-pressure 500 milliliter syringe pump is connected to its own pump controller. Empty the solvent collection beakers. Place 400 milliliters of reagent grade ethanol in a clean beaker. Transfer one syringe pump inlet feed tube to the beaker and fully open the corresponding pump inlet valve. Then, on the syringe pump controller, select constant flow in the port connecting the controller to the pump transducer. Start filling the syringe pump with ethanol at 70 milliliters per minute. Monitor the flow rate reading and the solvent level in the beaker. Express the air from the pump. And once the syringe pump is full and pumping has stopped, Close the inlet valve. 